Hmm? Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a haul video. I feel like haul videos do so well on my channel, which is why I'm filming another one. I don't really like to show people my purchases because I feel like they're quite private. But without further ado, let's just start. I hate long intros, so let's just get right into it. So I'm going to start with something big because I feel like it's exciting. First thing that I got is this Dior wallet. Let's unbox it. I actually did unbox it. That's why it's all over the place and I don't have the bag right now. This is what it looks like. Open it up. It's a vertical card holder and it's from the men's section. I have always wanted a Dior card holder, but when I saw it, it wasn't very practical. And for me, practicality is so important. And since I love using card wallets and I only carry cards around when I'm in the States, I thought this would be really great. It has eight pockets for your card. I'm planning on putting some cards in and then slip in some cash for emergencies. But right now I'm not using this wallet in Hong Kong because I use a lot of cash here. I feel like the men's wallets are more practical than the women's. So I highly recommend checking them out if you have a lot of cards. I was only going to buy this one product, but my mom and I got distracted and checked out something else. So, oh my gosh, I need to tell you a story about why we went to Dior in the first place. We went to the Dior in Pacific Place and Pacific Place invited mom and I to this like Dior little pop-up. And we went there and it was kind of disappointing, but we wanted to try out this ring. And I thought it was from the ring that was there at the pop-up, but no, they were like, oh, we're gonna like bring it from the store. And so we were waiting for like five minutes and the ring was still not there. So my mom and I were like, oh, okay, we're, we're gonna like leave. There's nothing to see here. There's no point for us to wait for five minutes for the ring because we weren't even going to buy the ring we just wanted to try it out if it was there at the spot so we can just see and be like ooh ah and then take it off and leave so we lied to the worker there and said uh we'll just go to the store ourselves we weren't going to go to the store we're just going to go home but he literally followed us all the way to the store he's like oh like i'll lead you guys to the store and that's where we were exploring and started to get distracted by all these dior things back to what i got after the wallet, I got this. Can you guys guess what it is? <laughs> of course, obviously the saddlebag. So this is what the bag looks like. It was a whole like process of trying out different bags to finally reach this one. If you guys don't know, this is the matte edition. They have a lot of different textures. And in the beginning, I was drawn to the pattern on my wallet. I can't believe, I can't think of what the name was called. I was choosing between that one and just like the normal leather. And I was definitely drawn to the pattern. But I just asked if they had any of the matte versions and they said they have this one and they were sold out of the gray. So I just tried this on and it was such a vibe. It's just my style and I love how Everything here is matte. So I went with this one. I thought it was more unique. Okay, so that's everything that I got from Dior. My mom got a few things. She got a few glasses. I kind of want to show you guys the glasses. Let me bring them and see if I can find them. My mom decided she wanted some housewares from Dior and she got this. This is so cute. It's basically a wine glass. It's 100% crystal and you guys can see. This is the Diorama pattern, like this thing here. It's the print on the Dior bags, Dior lady bags. So I thought this was so unique, so cool. And she got four. So yeah, this is the glass that she got. It's not so, oh, this is Dior, but if you know Dior as a brand and if you know their designs and if you appreciate them, um, you can definitely tell that it's Dior. So I think it's really subtle and it's really cool. Um, I'm gonna put it back before proceeding to the rest of the haul. Okay, next I bought a few things from Zara. I just needed a lot of summer clothes. I did not bring any to Hong Kong. So the first is this dress. It's just so nice. Um, it's a little collared shirt dress with a drawstring in the middle. So it's like a little baby doll shaped 
dress next is this piece it's so cool it's like the rattan kind of sweater but it has holes in it so it's not too hot the back is just like a blouse material i mean i love zara pieces because they're not as expensive and they're so trendy and they're quite good quality i've had some of my zara pieces for such a long time and to go with though the top that i just showed you i got these pants these pants work they're just really big flowy pants and then next i got this little shirt um i thought you know this would be very very nice for the really hot summers of hong kong i'm literally sweating so much right now because my ac is not turned on and i'm hot next i got a few things from the sale i got this little vest and i love it it's just this really really nice green color and you can wear it with anything like i can even wear it with my dress right now yeah, so i don't know if this is still available because it's on sale um it's on clearance so i also got this this was also on clearance yeah it's one of those like what do you call these a top with just arms okay so that's it for zara next i'm gonna be talking about some beauty things that i recently got that i didn't mention firstly is this nars mini afterglow lip balm duo this is something that my mom got me and i don't know how she knew that i like this but i'm currently using the bobby brown one and the dior one so i haven't opened it up but this is the first thing um, she also got me this 3d brow tones by benefit i don't really use the brow tones as much but i think this is such a useful product to have it just makes your brows like evenly colored and like smooths them out she also got me this benefit gimme brow i love gimme brow this is one of my favorite brow products and i'll definitely use this i also have tom ford soleil lip balm in the shade number seven paradiso I need to show you guys the packaging because it's so cute. Oh, it'll be so nice in my little Dior bag. Look at this. And the color, guys. It's such a beautiful color. I was like, Mom, I don't need this. You can, you can use it. And then I saw the color and I'm like, so I take that back and I'll take it from you. And then I also have this Dior Addict Lip Glow Oil. I love, I've been wanting to try this oil for so long. So I'm really happy about it. I use lip oils all the time, so this will be really, really useful. And it's the shade Cherry, and it's this really beautiful um, pink color. My mom also got me, my mom bought me a lot of things. She's always thinking about me, so I really appreciate it. If she's, wa she's watching this video, so thanks, mom. She got me this Dior Forever Perfect Cushion. I love these Dior cushions, and I've always been telling her about how much I love them. And I think this will be perfect with my... Dior wallet. This is the product. I love getting these if I can because they're limited edition, so they'll never come out. Um, so yeah, I feel like the Dior ones are even more special. I did have a Dior cushion um, before and it was like a slightly different design, but I think I prefer this one because it was like a studded Dior cushion and all the studs and the Dior lettering all came off. And then she also got me the sunscreen, Obagi Sun Shield Matte sunscreen lotion hopefully this is good i literally just am nearly done with my current sunscreen so this would be really great and then i also recently bought the rare beauty always an optimist base for primer because i'm nearly done with my tatcha primer so i think this would be really useful okay so the last two products are some skincare that i asked my aunt from korea to send me because i can't go to korea right now which really sucks um, so this is this cleansing oil. It's the Lanbell Natural Deep Cleansing Oil. I love this so much. I just started using it like two days ago. The oil just works so well in erasing my makeup. And it's so lightweight and it smells like lime or lemons. It smells like lemons. Love it. It doesn't break me out. It's perfect. It's very lightweight. So I have no complaints. And then I ran out of my serum. If you look at my quarantine skincare routine video, you'll see that I was using the Youth to the People serum, but I finished it already. This is something that I started using today. Um, this is a Celimac Noni Ampule. I've heard a lot about it last summer. And I know I'm like one year late on the bandwagon because no one really talks about this ampule anymore, but I really wanted to try it out. Um, and I really like it so far, but I need to definitely try it out longer for me to like confirm anything or judge a product that is it for my haul 
Thank you so much for clicking into it and watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel or just comment on it, anything you want to. Um, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. Subscribe and I'll see you next time. Let me know what you guys want to watch. Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm.